There was a man who lived in Cyprus at the Hippodrome. His name was Acacius, and he was a bear keeper there. There was a woman that all we know is that she was a dancer and an actress. These two got married and had a child named Theodora. <laughs> Theodora decided to follow in her mother's footsteps and become a dancer and an actress. Being a dancer and actress wasn't nearly as glamorous as it is right now. In fact, it was of the lower class. Theodora started dating a man named Justinian. Justinian was the nephew of the emperor at the time. These two got married. Wait! Hold on, according to the rules, upper class people can't marry lower class people. After a long, vigorous, and might I say, very boring discussion, Justinian was able to convince the emperor to change the law. When Justinian's uncle died, he inherited the throne. Thus, Theodore was the empress. Now, normally, empresses wouldn't have much power. They were like the Queen of England. But Justinian considered their intelligence to be equal, so he decided they should have about the same amount of power. So, she controlled stuff such as women's rights and foreign rights, but she didn't control stuff such as wars. The list went on and on, but more or less it was split 50-50.